Oh, I don't know if it works. Oh, I started a video, but then the jogger down the road went by, and Charlie will chase him. Not to be mean, but because he wants to play. Anyways, now I gotta start over. So, as you know, I built my garden from their original garden. I had to rip out the raised beds, and I put them way over there. And then we rototilled all this and got that mulch, which was sour, and it stunted the growth of everything. But now everything's starting to look good. So we planted a whole bunch of corn. We already pulled two from there and used it. These ones aren't doing too well, but they still got a couple stalks. Somehow that's got two corn stalks, and that one's doing the best. It's got like five or six on there. And then in the cups, we have more started. Not sure what that was. The seeds got mixed up, so I just threw it there anyways. Um, this is a hybrid tomato. Oh, I forgot what it was called. Bodacious Hybrid. I bought it from Burpees. And then this is Aroma, which I just bought the seeds for. And then the rest of these, all the way down, both two rows, were supposed to be cherry tomatoes. But somehow, this plant is growing normal-sized tomatoes. But we have tomato plants everywhere. Lots of cherry tomatoes. I come out every day and pick them. Plus, once they turn orange, you got to pick them or you're fighting with the birds. And they'll take one bite and leave it. And then when you go to pick it, it's a soft, gross cherry tomato. See, the sun's starting to come up. We should have went in and changed, man. I can get shit done. This is my cantaloupe. Which, again, I started stuff early because things weren't work. I mean, late because things weren't working out. But I got one. A huge one. There he is. It's actually almost ready. Look at that color. You should actually clip it soon. And then I had a few small ones on here. Uh, if I can find it. I got to go through and trim all this shit. Where'd he go? Better not have died. I've been noticing that. Some of my stuff is dying for some reason. Like it starts to grow. And then it's like, nope, never mind. I'm gonna turn yellow. But I don't know where I went. There's another couple in here, small ones. Maybe the size of a golf ball. And then we got that one, which is a watermelon plant. Now these are getting fairly good size already on there but I uh, had one in the back no Charlie no I see I knew it was you no no shit look what you just did no no it's not a toy get out of there get the fuck out of there dude Ooh. another one another one so I was weeding and I found, oh, can you see it? Oh, I can't tell. Yeah, right there under that leaf, right there is a good sized watermelon. And then, what the hell is that? Look at that one. It was growing and then it died. Oh, I'll open it up, see if there's any seeds. That sucks. But it's doing good. Got a whole bunch of little ones on there. With another one right there. And we got that big one in the back. So Charlie did the same thing. Something up in the back, which I'll show you. Come here, get out of there. I had potatoes right in here. And no, Charlie, stop that. And I, uh, I got about half a bag, a little over a half bag tomatoes. I mean, potatoes from it. Get out of there. Now over here. It was supposed to be cauliflower, but between the bunnies and the bugs that kept getting in, they look like shit. Um, but they're starting to produce, if you can see in the middle right here, it's got the bulb. It's starting to. Um, or we put another, I gotta do this side though, put another thing of netting up and then we're putting boards at the bottom like up there. This is more corn, just in case, because the bunnies keep eating everything. Second row of tomato plants, potatoes. This was supposed to be broccoli, but as you can see, 
Rabbits ate the shit out of it. Even though we ate that one starting. We just gotta keep them out. So that was a dragon fire pepper. Yeah, pepper hot dragon cayenne. So I've gotten a couple off it, but the rabbits kept eating that too. And it just started coming back. So we got a flower, so that means we're gonna get some. And then this was supposed to be a bell pepper, and the fucking bunnies ate it all the way to the stem. And then it started growing like this a couple weeks ago, all bushy. They ate my green beans. That's a green bean. Green bean. Green bean. Green bean. Green bean. And they ate all that too. I got one green bean hanging off that one though. Um, and then I plant, because green beans grow fast. I uh, started them in the house in uh, paper towels. And then brought them out just the other day. And they're already starting to sprout up. I did three different kinds. I did another section here. Again, I'm not sure what these were because seeds got mixed up. And I just threw them in there. I had to put Charlie in here with me because we had the guy that does his morning run um, jog by. And Charlie will chase. Not because he wants to be mean, but because he wants to play. Alright, on to the next one. Hopefully he doesn't come back for a while. Oh, my back. So we had natural basil and thyme and chives growing in here, but because, look at you pretty boy, but because everything was all mixed up in the garden, we pulled it and then put it on the outside, and it did not like it. So this brown spot was the basil, and right next to it, all that, is chives, and then next year, um, Kale will grow up over there because it's all already here, and then that's my asparagus garden. Um, I weed whacked one half. I'm gonna weed whack the other half. It's still growing. It slowed down, but it's, it still grew. I still got to move this box over to that side. I haven't done it yet. These are strawberries, as you can see, still getting some strawberries. And this was soil from last year at the apartment. And my morning glory started growing in here. So I just left it be. But we have wild morning glories. See the white spot right there? And right there, right there, right there. Those are wild morning glories. I'm going to actually collect the seed pods. This was the carrot bed. Uh, me and Jay pick most of them. I gotta put more sand in there. And then uh, start some more seeds. This was lettuce, but the bunnies got to it, and it's just starting to come back because we fenced it better. And then I put more green beans. Well, these green beans were here, but I planted some more in here like I did in the big garden. Because green beans grow fast. Cucumbers. I already pulled um, two giant, giant cucumbers off this one. And I still got a whole bunch growing in there. Maybe there's a big one right there. Oh, just broke a line. That's a big one. Got that one. Got one in there. Another one there. I got a whole bunch of... There's another one. Got a whole bunch of cucumbers going. I like growing vertically, especially things that vine and can hold it. It's a good idea. This, I wasn't sure what it was. It was dying. I just threw it in here, and then it started thriving in here. And now I'm not sure if I have, I think it's squash. I got one there. Got a baby one right there. There's quite a few in there. It's growing really good in that compact space. And then it started coming out the side, so I just left it. So... I'm just gonna continue leaving it. And the blueberry bushes already gave us blueberries, but the ones that are enclosed are actually going another round. Okay, got some more blueberries. I know it's a long ass video, but I'll give you the rundown. So, and again, seeds got mixed up, so we just planted this up here because we were gonna clear this out and make this a cornfield, which is gonna happen for next year. Um, I thought it was a squash because the way it was growing with the trunk there. 
Um, but now that it's circular, I believe it's a pumpkin. Charlie did that, if you can't tell. I hope it doesn't ruin it, so I gotta figure out how to keep it good without it dying on me. And that one, dying. But we got another little baby over there. Another one on there. Ugh, that one's dying too. I don't know why they're not taking. I went through myself and made sure they were cross-pollinated. I gotta check on Charlie before he gets out of the garden. But yeah, that's uh, most of the gardens. And next year, this is all gonna be cleaned out. I'm gonna move the other raised bed to over here. And then I'm gonna make uh, raised beds that are hip height with a trellis so you can walk between them and it'll look good. And I'm gonna do gourds and I'm gonna actually try to grow loofahs next year. <laughs> What are you doing, buddy? You still in there? The, the gate's open. <clears throat> it's getting hot, man. Hey, come on. Let's go inside for a few. Let's change. And then we can come back out and you can help mommy. We gotta fill uh, the carrot bed. And finish putting the baseboards on this. Come on. Come on. <clears throat> Excuse me. And here we go. Oh, yes, handsome. Come on. I'm going to shut the gate. Yeah, this way. Come here. This way. Come on. <laughs> Say bye-bye. Come on.